Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. Today I have some new fragrances from Candles by Victoria to share with you. She released nine new fragrances for the month of August. Um, so I'm just going to get started. Thankfully there's only nine so this shouldn't be too long. But the first one I have here is Grape Apple Twist. And as the name would suggest, this is a mix of grape and I believe it's green apple. The main scent in this is definitely grape. Um, there's also another like aspect to it. I wouldn't necessarily say, oh, that's a green apple, at least not um, when it's cold. Maybe when it's melting, you can smell the apple more, which I was hoping to smell more because I do I do love apple scents. Um, I'm not a fan of grape scents. To me, they can kind of smell artificial, a little bit medicinal. So this one is definitely not my favorite, but if you do like those like grape scents, I think you'll like it. Um, the next one is Mississippi Mud Pie, and this one's definitely one of those like sweet um, bakery scents. I smell chocolate in here, caramel, like brown sugar. Um, this one is a mix of Get Me S'mores and Log Cabin. So I'm assuming that's why that's where I get the chocolate from. And the lob, the lob, the log cabin would be kind of like that sweet, like maple syrupy type scent. Again, not my favorite. I don't really like like overly sweet bakery scents, but I know a lot of people do. Um, this one is called Desires in the Dark. And this one I do like. This one's definitely more perfumey, um, a little bit kind of like a clean scent. This is a mix of Dark Kiss and Sexy and Stiletto. So if you've smelled any one of those, you know that they're like perfumey, um, kind of florally type scent. So this one I do like. Um, the next one I have is Glazed Sticky Apples. And like I mentioned, I love apple scents. And this one you can definitely smell um, like a sweet kind of caramel scent. I definitely get a lot of like orange in here as well. Not so much apple. I smell a little bit of apple. Again, hopefully when it's melting, you'll smell it a little bit more. This one is caramelized pralines and apple jack and orange peel. So I can definitely smell the orange peel. I can smell the caramelized pralines and then hopefully the apple jack and peel comes, comes through when it's melting. Next, I have sunshine kiss. And I like this one a lot too. If you like um, fruity scents, you'll like this one. This one's definitely a sweet fruity scent. This is a mix of blushing peaches and papaya water lily. And I've had blushing peaches on its own as a candle. And it's very, very strong. Very, very good scent throw. Um, really sweet though. So I could only keep it on for just a few minutes because it would really just scent up the whole house. And it was a very, very strong fragrance. But this one I like because you still get that blushing peaches scent. It's like the first thing that you smell, but it's not as strong because it is mixed with the papaya water lily, which I honestly, it's hard to smell because the blushing peaches is so strong, but it just kind of cuts it back just a little bit and gives it a nice kind of fresher scent. Next is Sweet Summertime. This one smells very much of like watermelon, um, like candy. Um, let's see, this one's a mix of blue raspberries and watermelon taffy. So I can definitely smell the watermelon taffy scent. And then you do have that like blue raspberry. It kind of smells like a blue raspberry, like icy or slurpy. It's, it's a sweet, fruity, kind of candy-ish scent. Next, I have the Hunger Games and... This one I really, really like. Like I said, I love apple scents, and this is a mix of two different apple scents. And it's really, really nice. I really like this one a lot. This is Candied Apple and Enchanted Apple. So it's not like a bakery apple scent. It's definitely, it's more of a perfumey apple scent. It kind of reminds me of like a Victoria's Secret scent. Enchanted Apple, is that a Victoria's Secret scent? I don't know, but it reminds me of like, like an apple scented like lotion or body spray or something like that. I do really like this one a lot. Next is Truth or Dare, and this one is a mix of Sexy and Stilettos and Twilight Woods. And I do like this one a lot as well. I think I definitely smell more of the Sexy and Stilettos. Not so much, not so much the Twilight Woods, although it's there. It has kind of like a kind of warmer, kind of musky scent. And the last one I have here is Hanky Panky. And this one I do like too. It's it's fruity, it's kind of floral, and a little bit sweet. Kind of powdery as well. This one is a mix of white ginger and pink chiffon. So I don't know if I... I don't know if I would necessarily say, oh, that that's what that smells like. But to me, it's just a nice kind of mix of sweet, fruity, and floral. Although I don't really know if there's any fruit in this, but that's kind of what I'm getting. 
And those are the nine new fragrances for Candles by Victoria for the month of August. She's not having a sale this month because she had the big 25% off sale last month, but the code CBVICTORIA still works to save you 10% off on your order. So speaking of big sale from last month, let me know if you guys ordered anything and what you guys think of the things you've gotten. I actually placed an order, but I am planning on picking it up at Candles by Victoria maybe sometime at the end of this month. Not really sure yet, so I'm excited to get that. But yeah, let me know what you guys guys have been burning lately and what some of your favorites are. Thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you later. Bye!